sure you're all right? I said I'm fine! Hey, if something happened, you can tell me. Just let me... Get the hell away from me! I wonder where he picked that up from. Okay, Richard. I get the picture. Doesn't change a goddamn thing. Okay. Mommy? What's going on? Shh, listen to me, Richard. Listen to my every word. Some men will come to our house tonight. But why? What do they want? Shh, it's okay. I told them to come. And he walks weird. The hell is this? No! Stay away from me! Stay back! Get away from me, you bastards! No! No! Let go of me! No, please don't! Any son of Poland who collaborates with the oppressor. Hmm. Who steals from, denounces, or otherwise acts against his compatriots. First house on the left, right next to the river, with the old cherry tree in front. They're hiding them in the pantry, under the floorboards. They let them out sometimes to stretch out, usually later in the day. Some of them even go out sometimes, probably looking for food. Best to come at night. Mm-hmm. Yeah. It's an unforgivable crime against the motherland. Oh, sad. Oh, swiftly punished. What not happened to a nicer guy? on the PC. Uh, you don't really fight. There's a couple of times where you fight and you're just using like your spirit power, we'll call it. Like the spirit blast that he's giving off. But you play as the, uh, the main female character up until roughly this point. Um, I don't know, I really like it though. It, it gives me all the spooky vibes in all the right ways. I can't complain. Uh, I mean, other than the controls, because it'd be much better on an Xbox controller. Much better on an Xbox controller. But otherwise, good. And also, thank you. This is getting tedious. Rose! Where are you? I'm sorry! Please, come out! Oh. 
Oh, buddy. I called it. I'm just saying. Turns into an asshole, but she's gone. They took her from me. You took her from me. This way? Question. <laughs> I also look like that when I jog, by the way. I don't know where to go. Where I am go now.
over here, kid. Please, mister, I need help. The monster, it's after me. Monster, you say? And what does this monster look like? Sir, there's no time. Hurry, we have to get out of here. It's okay, Richard. Why don't you take a moment to catch your breath? Do I know you, mister? Are you one of my stepfather's friends? No, kid. I'm not planning on making any friends. I'm here just for you. <gasps> Sorry, kid. I know you tried to run, to hide. Get your hands off me! But as long as you're here, the beast will always find you. Richard. Hmm. Okay. It was pretty overwhelming at first. Thomas being like me, but different somehow. I guess I don't have to tell you. <gasps> Thomas? Who the hell are you? That's me. His whole life hiding, hoping they wouldn't find him. I gave him shelter. I gave him purpose. He could have been so much more. Instead, he chose to rot in this godforsaken place. suffered because of you? The one you preyed upon? She came to me because she had nowhere else to go. Where was her father then? Where were you? Oh, shut up! Stop acting like you ever cared about her! She was the light of my life. The warmth of my soul. Your soul has rotted away. There's barely anything left. No, it's just your sins. I almost feel sorry for you. You're nothing. Judge, I'm just the fairy man. 
Be gone. Richard. This time, it wasn't just a feeling, it was a memory. Had I been here before? Was I a part of the puzzle? This man, Thomas, was he a part of my own past? And then, something clicked. That girl. It's me. But it looks like it was taken here, at Neva. I think this is actually where I'm going to end it for today. <sighs> That's interesting. Kind of already had that vibe that uh, she had something to do with Neva in the past or she's related to Thomas or mm, something along those lines. Still putting the pieces together, but I also don't want to speculate too much. I like when the story unfolds for you, not when you are able to see the whole thing from the get-go. But, anyway, thanks for watching. Appreciate you. Mm -hmm.